The 2018 InMed Awards. The history of healthcare for forgotten people is highlighted by professionals who inspire their colleagues towards similar service. InMed is pleased to continue this effective tradition by announcing annual recipients of the InMed Awards at the Humanitarian Health Conference. The InMed International Healthcare Preceptor Award. This award recognizes an individual who has made an important impact in training future international healthcare personnel. The 2018 InMed International Healthcare Preceptor Award recipient is James Fife. James, a Kansas City native, began his career as a youth pastor in El Salvador. James later qualified as a registered nurse, serving at St. Luke's Hospital and North Kansas City Hospital. At the 2012 Humanitarian Health Conference, James met representatives from a healthcare organization working in a remote location in Asia. In 2015, James and his wife Rosie moved to that nation with their two preschool children. James' main responsibility in Asia continues to be instructing and mentoring national nursing students to give quality care to their own people. James, who was a volunteer at the very first InMed Humanitarian Health Conference in 2006, is also today an InMed International Medicine Fellow. The InMed Cross-Cultural Healthcare Leadership Award this award recognizes one who has made a significant leadership contribution to bridging cultural gaps in healthcare services and has set an example for other leaders to emulate. The 2018 InMed Cross-Cultural Healthcare Leadership Award recipient is Mary Smith. In 1988, Mary, a master's degree trained registered nurse, traveled with her Methodist church to Haiti. Motivated through this event, Mary herself led multiple teams back to Haiti over the coming years. In 1999, while teaching nursing at Johnson County Community College, she began taking nursing students to Mexico, where they provided care to those living in a squatter's community. That annual college trip continues even today. In 2009, Mary Smith made an exploration trip to Uganda. Thus, began annual visits to that nation as well, where for Ugandan nursing students and faculty, she continues teaching Helping Babies Breathe, a skill set she acquired through InMed in 2010. Mary advises, first go to walk alongside. As you do so, observe, learn, trust, respect, and let them teach you too. The InMed National Healthcare Service Award this award recognizes a citizen who is a role model in providing health care for his or her own people. The 2018 National Health Care Service Award recipient is Betsy Sutherland. As an elementary school teacher, Betsy became absorbed over the tragedy surrounding human trafficking, including labor, sex, and child trafficking. She carried these convictions into medical school at St. Louis University, where her experience in education was quickly recognized by her peers within the anti-trafficking community. Betsy is connected with the Stop Human Trafficking Network, where she leads small group hands-on trafficking case simulations to help learners to rapidly recognize and respond to abusive situations. Watch for more advocacy and innovation from Betsy Sutherland in the next chapter of her life as a family physician in South Bend, Indiana. The InMed Common Ellis Award for Compassionate Service to Humanity. This award was established by the InMed Board of Directors to recognize people who demonstrate care and concern for the needy, who give selflessly of their time and resources, and who inspire others to take similar action. The 2018 Common Ellis Award for Compassionate Service to Humanity recipient is Fred Loper. As a medical student at the University of Oklahoma, Fred Loper was recruited to help start Good Shepherd Clinic in Oklahoma City, a ministry launched after a homeless man had his wounds stitched by a bartender in a local tavern because he had nowhere else to go for treatment. Following graduation, Dr. Loper proceeded to lead the Baptist Medical Dental Fellowship for 12 years, facilitating healthcare in Guatemala, Dominican Republic, Ghana, and Cuba. 2012 through 2016, Dr. Loper was again at the helm of Good Shepherd Clinic, providing medical and dental care to low-income and uninsured people throughout central Oklahoma. 
In this context, he also mentored students from the University of Oklahoma Health Sciences Center, who enjoyed the inspiring privilege of witnessing Dr. Loper's excellence in action.